Hi right, guys, welcome back. Sorry I got cut off in the last one. I only um, allowed five minutes with the screen recording action. Um, going ahead and continuing from here, we need to um, be in Photoshop, obviously. But we've uh, set this measurement point here. We're going to add two more measurements points for the uh, reflection there at the bottom. All right, so we're going to add this down. We've got our guy there. That's, um, let's add that guy right there. All right, from here, we're going to go ahead and we're going to turn off those, uh, the guys, by pressing... Uh, command colon. We're going to turn off the, um, we're going to enable our layer mask there. We're going to turn off our uh, highlight and we're going to turn off our background. Okay. Same process as making the green reflection. We're going to press command A for select all. We're, we're going to do a short command for the other one. We're going to press command shift C and then we're going to press command V. Okay. So that's duplicate. Uh, we've duplicated our deal now. So we're going to go ahead and line this guy up. Make it uh, probably the easiest action to do that. Okay, pressing Command-0, we're going to turn on back that black layer. All right, so we can see what we need to do. Pressing Shift, or Command, colon, to turn our guides back on. We're going to press Command-T, pulling up Free Transform, and we're going to select Distort. Okay, we're going to bring this guy down. Whoa. It's right there. We'll bring this guy up to the bottom of the battery. All right, this guy down just a little bit more. All right, these guys coming out now. I'm going to line this guy up right out here. All right, and then this guy right out here. All right, let's go ahead and apply that. Bring this guy down just a touch. That's good. Now, cool thing is, we're going to apply the same effects that we used on the other one. So we're going to go ahead. And we're going to see what we use there. It looks like it was 30%. Um, so we're going to take that and make that 30%. All right. Cool. So we don't have to make this layer mask again. We can just duplicate it. So we're going to press Alt, click on the layer mask, drag it to the next layer, and apply it to that layer now. Cool thing is now we have both the red and the green. All right. Um, that has been a demonstration of creating an iPhone uh, battery illustration. Uh, thanks for your time. I hope you've learned a lot, and we hope to see you soon. All right. Bye.